I'm Miracle Rogers Campbell. I am a student, I'm a junior at Creative Arts High School. I think the biggest thing I've learned is that often educators and teachers especially, they're kind of on the same page as we are, like as far as wanting to include us and wanting to um, ask us these different things that we want them to ask, but because both parties are silent, you know, we don't really know if that, connect that, that connection exists. Hi, I'm Davina. I'm a student at Birthville High School. I'm going to be a senior. Uh, my teacher, she like invited us, and she told us about it and like everything that I'm like really passionate about. So I was like, this is like the perfect thing, and I've learned so much. And like, I, I'm still like, I don't know where I'm going in life. I mean, who really does? But like for career paths, so I, I think I have like a really good idea after today. <laughs> what is that? What do you think you'll do? Like just like education policy and like kind of like being part of making the big switch because there's still so much wrong. Because in the sessions, because um, I kind of also came here just to like learn as well other people's perspectives and how they saw the world and um, in quite a few of the sessions. Um, they were asking questions and kind of looking at me, like, you know, asking me about like, my personal experience and my like, life and stuff, not in a way of expecting me to speak for everyone, everyone, but in a general interest for, like, me and, like, my well-being and stuff like that. And I was kind of surprised, like, you want to hear me? You want to hear my vo like my voice? Are you sure? I was, like, almost looking around, like, mine? <laughs> and so that was really great to see, like, okay, they care. <laughs> Well, I'd say that um, though they have their uncertainties, um, it's just kind of a great opportunity because a lot of questions that they might have that they would think like, well, there's no way this event's going to answer that questions. I'd say they'd be surprised because before coming here, I had no idea what it was going to be like, and I was like, well, it might be like really structured and like barely answering anything, and it might be like the last conference I went to, and I was completely surprised and like really just kind of like blown away by um, just everything offered and all the different perspectives so I definitely say that it's worth taking a risk in. I will say that through it all like it's not been my necessary teachers who helped me it's the teachers that have brought me here today Miss Ramos and Ms. Sasta they my conversations with them are the realest things because there's no fake they're not like ignorant to a certain like this doesn't exist. They embrace it. They see that it's real and they talk about it because it's a problem. Mm -hmm. And I feel like one of my greatest conversations um, today, just alone, Miss Ramos told asked me. She asked me, "What's more important, to be treated like someone cares in your education?" and that are willing to meet your needs or someone that knows your story. And I told her it's not always important to know someone's story. It's someone that cares, that you feel that you can trust to tell them their story. I feel like everyone here wants to be here and thinks the same thing. And it doesn't really do anything if everyone believes the same thing without really doing anything. And I I'm lucky enough to have my principal here, and I'm like, he's in my, he's been in my group twice, and there's three groups, and so every time I'm emphasizing, I'm like, by the end, I literally told him, I was like, you can have a meeting with the teachers, and have them really know that having, building a relationship with a student is so important, and if other teachers don't realize that, there's no point. So, like, we can have all this talk, we can talk all day long about something, but if it's not really affecting people who don't believe the same things and they're not seeing that side of students who really want to see this stuff happen and that impact that they have, there's really no point. I just think that you need to know that we're not as afraid to address these things as um, people think, as many adults think, because um, our student equity the coordinator, she was, you know, she was like, in the beginning, she was really telling us, like, you know, um, if, if anything makes you uncomfortable, you know, don't be afraid to, like, let me know, like, you don't have, like, you know, she was, like, really making us feel comfortable, but, you know, um, 
as far as saying it might be intimidating, and I hear a lot of adults saying that this type of work intimidates them and it makes them nervous and stuff like that. But me, I'm just like, I've been waiting, like I've been at the starting line, just like ready for like ready for the gun to go off for me to like talk about this stuff. So I think adults should kind of consider that maybe we're not afraid. Like this is this conversation. We're the gener. This is the conversation we've been waiting for. We've been waiting for someone to ask this because we've got books in our minds about like ready to answer all of the questions that you have.